Hello. Hi friends, this is Pradeep. Now we will discuss about the database adapter, how to be used in the BPL of 11.1.1.3 version. So we will go to the console. There we will be having the services. Under this, you will be finding the JDBC data source. Click on the data source and create new one. Provide the name as demo ds name as jdbc hyphen demo ds copy this into your one of the notepad this jndi name next 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 database name is xc it's a local host username as system and the password as manager confirm password as manager next just the configuration connection was just succeeded connection test succeeded and then go for next and select the server as so server and then finish it now created one of the data source for that one so you want to go to the develop points go to the db adapter go to configuration Outbound connection pools. Uh, create new one. Select this one. Press the next button. Provide as EIS. Oh. EIS. JDBC. Demo. DB. Copy this. Join day name. then finish ok already the plan has been so that's why it asks us to, to modify it yeah so it has been changes has been done here ok once again go into the deployments and select the db adapter and update it next finish it See all ch changes have been actually no restores on SLS selected deployments instead. So now we'll create one of the table in our database. Create table student s number as number of four student name actual of hundred and s class as var of forty so we created the oh missing right pandas where I have been missed from my dear dear table stood s number of four s name Now I created the table. So describe 
let's treat the table so we are having three columns so now check the table is having any data or not so that starts from student so we are not having any data so okay now we'll create we'll go to the J developer and I created the application it's a DB application next DB adapt project select so next composite with people process DB adapt bevel process so it is synchronous okay see we got when I create the project we will get these or the minor things which will be getting so classes test suits XSD XSL business rules XML and bpl visual component type so in the composite.xml drag your database adapter and place it here select the service name as d and connection will uh, provide some connection to its uh, system manager will touch the connection so it is success then press ok then what is the jnd name we have been provided here just copy this one yes jdbc demo oh db next so here if you go it here go to configuration here if you go here demo database what is the source name is here is you forgot to give the jdbc demo ds so provide this value here and save it once again go to the deployments set the db adapter and update it next finish we are not established the we are not established the connection between the data source and the our uh, deployment where you have been deploying so now you establish the connection okay so so what operation you want to perform is insert or update only you are selecting here so which table you want to select it here by using query we will get the table names here there is a student table press ok so next so here you want to select the primary key defined I'm setting as S yes number. There is a relationship, so we are not having relationship. So I'm going for next. This are the columns which you are having. So here it's not if you want to do any. Uh, that means uh, how much time this table should activate in how many times that trigger all the things we can specify it here. Finish it. Now it doesn't require so just I done this one. Just run some drop it and go it here take the invoke activity and join these two create one input variable ok now go to the here day b adapter people process you are having only one input and one output if you go to d underscore table which has been created by the through your student which you have been created so here how many input variables you are having if you see it three inputs this to be mapped with this so go to the source
student number student name student class and then save it take the transform activity input here select as in no activity apply select the student collection go to add accessory for reach S number to S and O, S name to S name, and class to S class, and then save it, close it, up make the apply, and you okay. Validate this one, and if you check that tables what we got is JCA will say to what is the relation to us between the database and our paper process it will explain this JCA and this also what is the mappings and what are the properties you are having this two will be explained to us deploy db adapter Next, finish. Sorry. It's a deployment finish. So we'll go to here. So info under the default we are having deep adapter project. Go to test. So serial number one. This is. Pradeep M student class so uh, a class test web service now go to your address and run your stuff from so here the data has been inserted so from this way you can insert the database into the data okay